Long time no see, kid. <laughs> you look familiar. Same goes to you. It's good to see you again, King Piggy. It's been months since we first met. Well, in reality, it's been over a year. A year already? Dang, time flies, doesn't it? It sure does. Be honest with me. How do I look now compared to 2020? Now that I look at you, you look like such a poorly made piggy character that was recolored and dressed by a Draconia model. Yeah, that shows how much people evolved from piggy. I'm not as special as I was from before. Oh, come on, don't say that to yourself. You still look fine to me. <laughs> Thanks, kid. So, what am I doing here? Is this a dream or something? It's not just a dream, but it's also a vision. George, I'm not just here to talk. I'm here to tell you about what's been happening with you today. I saw what you did. You want to oof Willow. You can't use your powers just to do bad. I know you hate Willow. I do too. But remember, with great power- I know, I get it! <sighs> there are many reasons why I hate Willow so much. One, she took Zizzy away from us. Two, she broke into our safe place. Three, she broke my trap which almost led to us all screwed. Four, she almost killed one of my friends. Yes, I've seen all of it, but she couldn't control her anger. Everyone can make mistakes. King Piggy, she's an adult. She knows what she has done. I'm a kid. I know, George, but oofing her isn't going to make things better. I'm just scared, King Piggy. I'm afraid that I'll lose another friend I care about. Ever since we lost Sizzy, I felt broken in the inside. I felt hopeless to the point I just don't even care anymore. I thought it was over losing my family. But losing another loved one just hurts more. It's all her fault. Look, kid. I know the past can hurt, but we have to move on. Besides, you all are finding a cure anyways, so there's still hope for you. And you know, those tough times will make you stronger than before. Plus, you have teleportation powers. Kid, you have no idea how powerful you are. You just need more time to learn about yourself. You're right. I need to use my powers responsibly. Good! Maybe you also shouldn't hate people you immediately see. I don't want you to be one of them. You're young and you're still learning. Here's something I can tell you. People hate what they don't understand. That's basically society right now, isn't it? Correct. Yeah. So, uh... How do I wake up? I'll send you back. Okay. I have two more questions before I go. Sure, what is it? Do you think you'll ever come back to help us one day, King Piggy? I'll come back when you need it. For now, you're on your own, kid. You're strong enough to protect your friends. Okay. Also, if you're a king, does that mean Piggy takes place in the United Kingdom? <sighs> oh good, you're awake! Oh, hey. What are you doing here? We took a pretty nasty fall back there, so I took you to the beds. Oh. Thank you, Willow. Yeah, no problem. I don't understand. Why did you do all this in the first place? So, me and Lego were arguing inside the crate while you guys were upstairs. It comes to show how stupid I am these days. You had a family, right? I did have one, but I lost him to the infection. What about you? You're not alone, kid. I had a family once. My parents got arrested trying to take care of us. Or, at least that's what I thought they did. Then, a nice lady named Daisy came by and took care of us. But, she got sent to the military, so our mother figure left us after that. Then my little brother left me trying to find her. So I was left all alone for the rest of my childhood. Willow! I'm so sorry, how come you didn't tell us this before? It was a long time ago, so I thought it was unnecessary. Oh, I was too stubborn to understand you during that day. Also, how come you're not afraid of anything that gets in your way? The reason why I'm not afraid of anything is because... I literally got nothing to lose. If I ever get infected someday, then what's the point of being afraid if there's no one to support you? But we do. Let's hope the picky community doesn't see that. Yeah, there's already ships of us. Really? That's messed up. Yeah. Kid, I'm gonna make a promise to you. You were right about me. I'll never change. But, 
We will find a way to bring back your family, okay? What about yours? Mine's not important right now. Oh, come on, Willow. I'm sure we can find yours somehow, even a decade later. Miracles happen every day. <laughs> you got some wise words, kid. What's your name, by the way? I never asked. The name is George. Well, it's nice to meet you, George. I hear something from upstairs. We should go take a look. 